World War II, a global conflict that reshaped the world and left an indelible mark on the pages of history. This monumental event was not born in a vacuum. It grew from the ashes of the Great War, fueled by economic instability and the rise of totalitarian regimes in Germany, Italy and Japan. These nations, under the leadership of figures like Adolf Hitler, Benito Mussolini and Emperor Hirohito, became the Axis powers, igniting the spark that would engulf the world in flames. On the other side of the conflict, the Allies, led by the United States, the United Kingdom and the Soviet Union, stood in defense of liberty and freedom, setting the stage for some of the most significant battles in human history. From the beaches of Normandy to the islands of the Pacific, brave men and women fought with relentless determination, forever shaping the course of the 20th century. Amidst the chaos of battle, humanity witnessed the darkest corners of the human soul. The Holocaust, a systematic genocide led by Nazi Germany, resulted in the deaths of six million Jews. This horrific event is a stark reminder of the depths of cruelty that can be reached when hatred goes unchecked. The war also saw the dawn of the atomic age. The bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki by the United States brought about an unprecedented level of destruction, effectively ending the war, but at a tremendous cost of human life. Despite the devastation, World War II also gave birth to hope. The formation of the United Nations in 1945 marked a collective global effort to prevent such a catastrophic conflict from happening again. This international organization symbolizes the world's shared commitment to peace, security, and cooperation. The end of World War II didn't just mark the cessation of the deadliest conflict in human history, it set the stage for a new world order. In the ashes of World War II, two superpowers emerged, leading to a new kind of war. The Cold War. The stage was set for a conflict unlike any other. On one side of the ring stood the United States, a beacon of capitalism and democracy. On the other, the Soviet Union, a stronghold of communism and state control. The ideological differences between the two were stark and irreconcilable. This ideological conflict played out on various fronts. The arms race was one such front. Both nations poured vast resources into developing powerful weapons, including nuclear bombs. It was a high-stakes game of one-upmanship, with each side striving to have the bigger, more potent arsenal. The ultimate goal? Deterrence. The theory was that the threat of mutual destruction would prevent either side from launching a full-scale war. Then, there was the space race. The cosmos became yet another battlefield for these two superpowers. The Soviets took an early lead with Sputnik and Yuri Gagarin, the first man in space. However, the United States was not far behind, eventually putting a man on the moon in 1969, a feat that remains unrivaled. But the Cold War wasn't just about technological superiority, it also played out in the shadows of proxy wars. Countries like Vietnam, Korea and Afghanistan became chessboards, with the US and the Soviet Union moving pieces in a bid to spread their respective ideologies. This silent war had profound effects on global politics and society. It divided the world into two distinct blocks and created an atmosphere of fear and distrust. It shaped the way nations interacted, negotiating with caution and suspicion, always wary of the invisible line drawn by ideological differences. The Cold War was more than just a period in history. It was a battle of beliefs, a test of willpower, and a demonstration of the lengths nations would go to protect and propagate their ways of life. The Cold War, a silent battle of ideologies fueled by fear and distrust, forever changed the face of diplomacy and international relations. The Soviet Union, a superpower born out of revolution, would see its own downfall within a span of few decades. At the close of World War II, the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics emerged as a dominant force on the global stage. The USSR, as it was commonly known, was a federation of multiple nationalities, bound together under the banner of communism. Its rise to power was swift, propelled by its vast natural resources, industrial might, and the leadership of Joseph Stalin. 
After Stalin's death in 1953, a series of leaders attempted to keep the USSR's momentum going. However, the country was plagued by a stagnant economy, a political system resistant to change, and growing dissatisfaction among its citizens. The seeds of the USSR's downfall were sown within its own system. Enter Mikhail Gorbachev, who ascended to power in 1985. Recognizing the need for change, he introduced two transformative policies, glasnost or openness and perestroika or restructuring. Glasnost lifted the heavy censorship that had long stifled Soviet society, while Perestroika aimed to revitalize the economy through reforms. However, these policies had unintended consequences. Glasnost led to an outpouring of public criticism against the government, while Perestroika failed to deliver immediate economic improvement. The USSR began to unravel. Nationalities within the USSR, suppressed for decades, began demanding sovereignty. The Baltic states led the way, soon followed by others. The situation reached a climax in 1991, when a failed coup d'etat by hardline communists accelerated the disintegration. By December of that year, Gorbachev resigned as president and the USSR was officially dissolved. Fifteen independent countries emerged from its ashes, with Russia being the largest. The USSR's rise and fall were dramatic and swift, a stark testament to the volatility of global power dynamics. Its legacy continues to shape the world today. The fall of the USSR in 1991 marked the end of the Cold War era, signifying a major shift in global power dynamics. The echoes of World War II and the fall of the USSR continue to reverberate in our contemporary world. These seismic events of the 20th century have left indelible marks on our global landscape, shaping politics, economies and societies in ways that continue to unfold. The devastation of World War II gave rise to a new world order, with the United States and the Soviet Union emerging as superpowers. This ideological clash between capitalism and communism set the stage for the Cold War, a geopolitical chess game that spanned nearly half a century. The tensions of this period permeated every corner of the globe influencing politics, culture, and even science, as seen in the space race. But every empire has its day, and the Soviet Union was no exception. Despite its rise to superpower status, internal issues such as economic stagnation, political corruption, and social unrest led to its eventual collapse. This marked the end of the Cold War era, but not the end of its impact. The power vacuum left behind reshaped the geopolitical landscape, sparking conflicts and power struggles that continue to this day. And what of the lessons learned from these monumental events? They have taught us that ideologies cannot be enforced by might alone, that economies thrive with innovation and competition, not stagnation and control. They've shown us the price of war, the value of peace, and the importance of diplomacy in navigating international relations. These lessons from our past serve as guideposts for our present, helping us grapple with the complexities of our modern world. But perhaps the most poignant lesson is that history is not a closed book. The echoes of the past continue to reverberate in our present, shaping our future in ways we may not yet fully understand. History is not just about the past. It's a guidebook for the future. It is up to us to learn from it and shape a better tomorrow.